Hello everybody and welcome back to my Beyond Two Souls Let's Play. Let's continue, shall we? Jamal was around here somewhere. I don't have much time. Jamal's here. Okay, now find a place close to the house where I can take cover. You know what you have to do. Find Jamal and hide him. That's him. That's Jamal. I won't be able to get close enough. You're gonna have to do it, I think. I've got to do it. Orders are orders. The guy's got blood on his hands. He deserves to die. Come on. I can do this. I can kill him. I can kill him. Open the door for me. I need to confirm that Jamal is dead. Hurry! Hurry. Salim? Abi! 
أبي لا لا تموت يا أبي أنا بحاجة إليك يا لا تتركني لا تتركني لماذا فعلت ذلك؟ فكرت وأنا كصديقتي لقد قتلت أبي لقد قتلت أبي أنا أكرهك أنا أكرهك Well, that really sucks. Fuck. Fuck, we gotta get out of here. Ten years in the CIA. Never seen anything like it. Boss sends his own private helicopter to get an agent back. All the top brass are crazy about you, Jody. You and Iden, of course. Jody, you okay? Listen, I know this one was tough, but it's over. I'm going home. Just another mission accomplished, right? I'll never forget what I saw back there, right? Never.
How's your leg? Better when this painkiller kicks in. And the international community had just announced its official recognition of the election of the new president, Jamal Sheikh Sharif. Jamal Sheikh Sharif, one of the most dangerous warlords in the country. And now, sources report that he and all his government were assassinated in what appears to be an unclaimed attack. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. Hopes were high that the newly recognized President Jamal Sharif would be able to put an end to the hostilities that have ravaged his country for many years. A number of world leaders have already expressed outrage at what appears to be nothing less than a cold-blooded execution. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. You must have found you, Zalek. Fakal tu anaki sajikachi. You lied to me. What are you talking about? Jamal wasn't a warlord. He was the president. He was the democratically elected president. Your point? We're not politicians. We had our orders. You knew I wouldn't have murdered him. So you lied to me. Welcome to the CIA, Jody. It's not fucking choir practice in case you haven't noticed. Now, we had a job to do and we did it. End of story. This might just be fucking job to you, okay? But I don't go around killing people because some poor fucking star general tells me to. What's going on? Joe, listen, listen, just calm down. All right, we'll get back home and we'll talk about it, okay? You manipulated me. You used me to do your dirty work. What difference does it make? Jody, you was a dead man walking with or without you. I have blood on my hands. Some kid lost his father because of me. Because I trusted you. Because I trusted him. We were doing the right thing. What am I, me, Ryan? A toy? Some fucking puppet that you can just do whatever you want with? You're getting massive turbulence. Fuck! I can't, I can't control it. Jordan, for God's sake, you're gonna kill us. No one's ever gonna like me again, Ryan. Jordan! And that's the reason why I decided to ruin that dinner date in the previous video. Hey, Cole. Jody, my little princess. Oh, Ooh, let me look at you, girl. Oh my God, what a beautiful young woman you've become. Just as pretty as ever. The 
sad and lost. Like the first time I saw you. I can't even imagine how much I missed you. And how's Aiden? Oh, yeah. Uh, good to see you too, buddy. Walk with me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was worried. They're looking for you. I had to run away. I mean, I had no choice. Did you tell anyone that I called you? No, of course not. Not even Nathan. <laughs> Wouldn't do me any good to be meeting up with a known felon now, would it? <laughs> and you? What are you working on? I'm running a small group. We're trying to classify types of entities, see if they're different species, that kind of thing. It's not the highest priority, but I get to do what I want. So. How's Nathan? Oh, he's the big boss now. He's running the DPA. <laughs> he's come a long way since the days of our little lab. What I talked to you about? Did you find out anything? The day you were born, a woman named Nora Gray had a child in the DPA hospital. Her child was declared stillborn. What else did you learn about her? Not much. All I know is that she took part in the DPA research program some 20 years back. She also had a gift. Did you learn anything about him? His name was Jonathan Nichols. He died before birth. Heart failure. That's all I could find. Where is Nora now? She was interned in a psychiatric hospital just after she gave birth. According to her file, she should still be there now. up in a mental hospital. I'm sorry, Jody. I've got to go see her. Jody, I know how you feel, but she's in a mental hospital. You might not get the answers you're looking for. I'm not looking for answers. I just need to see her. I mean, don't you understand? She's my mother. If I look her in the eye, I could find out who I truly am. Jody. She's in a high-security DPA facility, and you're wanted by every law enforcement agency in the country. You won't be able to walk right in. Nothing's gonna stop me from seeing her. Look. You've taken a huge risk. Thank you, Cole. Hey. You didn't think I was going to let you go alone, did you? Jody. No guard on gate, empty parking lot. Something doesn't feel right. I'm not back in 30 minutes. Just go. Girl, I didn't come here to wait in no car. Cole, Cole, wait.
polite approach. I will do that next time, Cole. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.